Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to store any number for future calculations on your Casio scientific calculator. The model I have here is a FX300MS, but the feature should be consistent for similar models. This is a video from my scientific calculator tutorial series. I also have a graphing calculator tutorial series, so be sure to check out other videos on the channel. Without further ado, let's get to it. When saving values on your Casio scientific calculator, you can assign them a letter either A through F, uh, M, Y, or X. And I'm referring to the letter above the buttons that's in red. So we have A over the negative sign up to F over the tangent sign. And then we have M, Y, and X. So in order to save a number as one of these letters first just type in the number on the number pad so I'm going to save uh, 580 as the letter A so just type in 580 I just have 580 typed in uh, and now press shift and press the RCL recall button to select the store feature by hitting shift first we're selecting the uh, feature that's in the yellow color. So now we have uh, hit shift and the recall button. Just press uh, the button associated with the letter A, which is the negative sign. So just press this, and now you see that 580 uh, has an arrow to A. That means 580 equals A right now. And then I'm going to hit equals, and I'm just going to clear this out. Now I can use this for calculations. Let's say I wanted to do 8 times uh, the letter A. And to recall the letter A, just press the recall button and type in A. And now if I press equals, you see that I get the answer, which is 4,640. And you could have multiple values stored, like or you could have something uh, set to A, something set to B, and so on. So let's say you have two things set in uh, different letters. So let's say 580 and A and 90 and B. You could do calculations that way too. So quickly I'm just going to save uh, 90 as the letter B and I'm just going to show a quick calculation. So I'm, I'm just going to clear everything out, type in 90 on the number pad, press shift recall to select store, uh, store and then I'm going to press this button to uh, select B and now I have 90 uh, set to B press equals and just clear now I can recall uh, A press equals so just have A without the equal sign now I can do plus recall B and just press equals and I get the answer and you can do this for however many values you ha you saved and one thing to keep in mind you notice that after I recalled A I pressed equals before I added the B I think that's important to do because sometimes if you don't that gives you funky answers I hope this video was helpful if you haven't already please subscribe as always feel free to leave any questions in the comment section you can follow my channel on Facebook and post questions there also check out other videos on my channel and until next time take care guys